Hello, amazing and totally awesome people. I'm Kill Paris, and obviously you're crazy awesome if you're watching this video. In this video, this is actually a tutorial request from Weston Miller, which you can follow him on Twitter at DJ M O T O West. Uh, for the what we're gonna make is basically this sound right here. So this is the type of effect sound that you would use to transition between a breakdown in your main part or to go into a breakdown or like at the beginning or the end of a song. So you hear this all the time in dance music. And what we're going to use for this is we're just going to use a kick drum and then we're going to throw a reverb onto that. Now with the Ableton reverb, you can use any reverb you want, but um, we'll just keep this with Ableton stuff so everybody can do it. Um, so go to global quality, turn that to high, turn your high cut off, uh, maybe even do some low cut. Bring the size down, and you can, you can really set this all the way you know up however you want to, but you just need something with a really long decay. So let's hear what that's like. Turn the size down even more. Sweet, so you can kind of you can dial in the dry and wet however much you want, and the more you do this, the more you'll you know you'll know kind of what you're going for from the get go. So from here, all we need to do is control click and freeze the track. Yeah, stop the audio. Take a second, and then control click again and flatten. And so Ableton will do this. It'll actually slice this up as to your original like length of the original sample or kick drum. And then you'll have the second part, so just click and drag that out. We don't really need it uh, that far out, so let's just make it even. Click here, Command E to cut. We can select all this baggage and delete it. And so, what we're going to do is we're going to drag this out. Option and drag. Double click and hit reverse. Now let's hear what that sounds like. So if you just want to get rid of that and do it like this, it's like a little suck out type sound. Awesome guys, so I encourage you to make more of these. Obviously this is super super simple, but then you can add as many effects, delays, anything that you want to do. Just make sure you freeze and flatten. Like freezing and flattening is just really really underrated uh, feature in Ableton because you can just take something and then just completely mutilate it, freeze it, flatten it, and then completely mutilate it again and just, you know, before you, you have something that you, you know, never ever thought that you were gonna make in the first place. So. A lot of creativity and everything. Thanks for watching, guys. Please follow me on Twitter. Hit me up on Facebook at facebook.com slash killparis. I'm on SoundCloud at soundcloud.com slash killparis. I give out all kinds of free music and everything. And please like, rate, subscribe, share, do all that kind of crazy stuff. I'm starting to lose my breath. Uh, I will see you guys later. Love you. Peace.